They now say in five days' time, there is going to be snow. When they say snow, it's just like rain falling, and people will not be able to come out to go and walk. Are you there? So they now advise all the animals to gather food. No, they you are. To gather what? To gather enough food that they can eat. Because after these five days, there's going to be snow. People will not be able to come out to go and to go and uh, to go to farm or to go and buy things. So they, so they ask them to buy things and keep it so that when the snow starts, you can have enough food to eat. When everyone was busy, all the animals were busy finding food, going to farm to go and fed food. Grasshopper is playing around. Are you there? When he goes to ant, ant let us play now. Now, it's doing now. after some time, he was weak. He cannot walk again. He cannot even walk again. So ant now come. Are you there? Yes. What did I say ant is? Come. Now come. Uh, what is ant? Ant. You now come. I think I was telling you when you were playing. You said we have more time. Now, you are starving, you have no food. Next time, when they want you that you should do something, do it. Then, then the grasshopper, the grasshopper now say, I have learned my lesson. I have learned my word. I have learned my lesson. I will not when they advise us to do something, I will do it on time. Now, let's listen to the lessons of, uh, from this story. Number one, time waits for no one. Where I say it? Time waits for no one. Why did I say? Time waits for no one. Time waits for no one. Time waits for no one. Whether you are working or you are not working, time is going. Are you there? Yes. Whether you come to school or do not come to school, does it stop afternoon from turning to night? No. Does it stop night from turning to turning to morning? No. So whether you are doing what you are supposed to do or not, time is going. Now, Grandma, what did I say? Time is going. Number two, punctuality is a key to success. Punctuality is a key to what? Success. Let's say, for example, you are looking for a job and they ask you to come by 7 30 and you are going by 9 a.m. Are they going to give you that work? No. I will not give you because you are late. Punctuality. Punctuality. Make you feel confident. Punctuality makes you feel what? Confident. When you come to school as early as 7 15, your mind will be at rest that no one will say I am late, no one will beat me. You will be very confident that, okay, I am ready for the day's work. But when you are coming to school by 8 30, you will be asking, Is that in, in the class? You will not be so confident to enter the class. Are you there? Then another important lesson from this is that if you do not learn, if you do not learn by obeying instruction, you will learn by what punishment. If you do not learn by what by obeying instruction, you will learn by what punishment. You will learn by punishment. You know they said, gather food, keep it. In the next five days, there is going to be snow. But the grasshopper did not listen. The instruction that gather food, keep it. But when grasshopper did not listen, he was what punished. What did what uh, what kind of punishment did he face? She felt that he not eat. He was hungry. Are you there? He was what hungry. That is why everyone is going to learn at part time. Everyone is going to learn. Everyone is going to learn. Is it that you learn in an easy way or you learn in a hard way? The, the, the easy way is by listening to instruction. Don't make noise. Don't do this. Don't do that. 
If you do not do them, you are listening to instruction. What they ask you to do, you are doing it. You are listening to instruction. But don't do this thing, you are doing it. Do these things, you don't do them. That means you care will be used on you. So the best way for you is to listen to instruction so that you will not be punished. Now, this is this is this. Okay, that's that about that for today. So pause the video. The task, the activity I will give you in order to put what I have taught you into action. Are you there? Number one, come early to school on Monday. Come early to school on Monday. I want to know whether you listen to this and you digest it. If you do, make sure you come to school early on Monday. Monday. That is your task number one. Number two, make sure you get home early today after closing time. Your parents will ask you, ah, you came early today, you tell them that they taught you punctuality in the enlightenment program. That was the reason why all those places that I used to go, you will see Ken Ken here, you will drink Ken Ken, you will see here, you will go and play here. The students say, ah, you come to school, you come home early today. Why? You tell them that they taught us punctuality. So anything you are learning, you have to make it actionable. As they are teaching you, you should be using it. Thank you and God bless Mr. Camera.